Oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> You're already taking a job that's next week. That's next yeah, week, yes. girl. Excuse me. Pump your brakes. Excuse me. But Gio always says. <laughs> Who your jets? Um, hey guys, welcome back to Off the Record where we talk about whatever Ever we want. We want. <laughs> Can you wear blue hair next week too? Yeah. <laughs> Give her the pink one. Oh yeah. Give and it could wig. just be like a different Tiff. <laughs> Would you dye your hair? Tiff in an ultimate reality. What? Yeah, you could be. Would Biff. you dye your hair? I've never. I haven't dyed my hair Biff. since Biff. high school. I love your natural Biff. hair. Biff. Thank Biff. you. It's very luxurious. I enjoy it very much. There's a lot of bounce. <laughs> it's like a lot of bounce. A lot of bounce. Oh. I want to, this is the perfect time to tell the break, say this stuff. Yes. Uh, I wasn't going to say it. Exclusive. I, I'm not pregnant. Um, <laughs> so, you know, we're going to Vegas. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. And you guys were talking about how like plane tickets are kind of expensive. It's Easter weekend or and 420 weekend and whatever, whatever oh, the plane. Yeah. The plane tickets are expensive that weekend. Oh shit. Yeah. yeah. Did you check out a price? Say, I we didn't, were, but I heard a lot of people were driving. I, well, okay. What about it? Okay. So. I haven't driven to Vegas in a very long time, but when we used to drive to Vegas, there's this place called Deep Creek that, um, have you heard of it? No. Okay, so you camp there. Well, you don't have to camp there, but you can camp there. It's like $10 and you, you set up camp at the top and then you hike down 45 minute hike and there's a river and then at the top of the river, there's hot springs. So Super it's like there. a beach with a river Ooh. and then like, you, and then right above it is hot springs. So you're like in the jacuzzi and then you're like, oh, it's kind of too hot. And then you go into the river and you're like, oh, it's cool. And then- Let's do that. And it's it's kind of like a detox. It's like really fun. So on the way back from Vegas. Yeah. Do we have do to be naked? There or on the way back, but I would suggest on the way back because it feels like very refreshing. Do we have to be naked? There's a nudist colony that um, sometimes, not a lot of people, but like maybe like five or so nudists will be there at a time and you kind of get used to it because like they're submerged in the water usually. Do you want to get naked and go over there? Sure. It's kind of fun. It's With all of us, and there's no different levels. I already there's seen like his dick. Hot, I've seen Joe's dick one time. I already <laughs> seen his dick. <laughs> I purposely don't trim if I'm gonna go to a group setting. Really? Why? Because yeah. it feels like clothes. You don't want to be too free. Because it feels like clothes. You don't want anyone to sexualize you. Yeah, it's, there's nothing there. Cause it's just fur. I never realized how uneven my tan is until I go to like one of those naked spas. <laughs> so you walk by the mirror and you're looking like, God damn, that's ugly as fuck. It's like dark and then Wait, white uh, and a white ass and then dark. It's like you don't see it when you get in the shower. No, because you're not paying attention to that. You oh, know? I but then now when you're, <laughs> yeah. but now when you're in public, like you're more self-conscious. Mm. So you're like, oh, you self-conscious. I mean, it's still like only 3% maybe, oh. but it's more than usual. I look like chocolate covered ice cream. What the hell? <laughs> <laughs> no, that that sounds fun. Right? I want to do Vegas that. Vegas sounds fun, guys. Let's do it. We should do it on the, but do we have to leave earlier to beat the Vegas traffic back to LA? Because yeah, it's always crazy. You would either like leave in the morning on the day that you're coming back, yeah. leave in the morning and it would be like a day trip, or if you wanted to camp there, you would leave like the afternoon before, set up camp, have a camping trip, and then you're already there. Let's just do a day trip. Yeah, I think the day trip is better because yeah. Steve fucking hates camping. <laughs> he he I, does? We, of no. course, oh, come on. You don't but think he would, he, you think he would like camping? He's, he's not, white, he's I thought he loves it. But he's plugged in all the time. No. He has to, you know what I mean? True. He needs to be showered all the time. If, if Steve oh. could upload his brain in a laptop, I think he would. <laughs> into a monster drink. Yeah, into a monster drink. <laughs> he'd be happy. <laughs> you wanna be, he, he'd be a monster drink with arms. Arms. Yeah, <laughs> that's what he wants to reincarnate. When I go camping though, I still wash myself though. Yeah, so do I. I try to stay as clean well, as I, I can. I guess this place, there's no showers, but there's, there's river. the river and yeah. the the springs. That's pretty fucking good. It's called Deep Water Creek. It's called Deep Creek. Deep Creek. Yeah. That sounds like a porn, dude. Yeah. Deep <laughs> Creek. Yeah. Deep, Deep Creek deep part five. With the should nudists. We, should we be bleeping out every time we're saying this? Because then a whole bunch of people are going to want to go. They don't know which weekend we're going. Oh, I she did say. say. I could take out the dates. You could take out. Well, they don't know what day we're going to go. Well, yeah. we're not uploading before we're going. So oh, we just don't okay. tell them that it's May 8th again. We don't say that. Yeah, don't say it's May 8th. Yeah. <laughs> Can't wait till we yeah. get both. But it's really fun. And then they have like this, this one part where like the hot water from the springs is like pouring off and it's like a shower. Ooh. Yeah. That sounds awesome. Damn, I gotta look it up. Yeah. Let's do it. it sounds yeah. refreshing cool. and awesome. Yeah, we're not bringing Taika. So Fuck yeah. Be cool. Perfect. Whatever, fool. You're like, man, how's the baby doing? I know, I, I love that dude. But then when we get alone time, which is almost never. When you get alone time. Yeah. How many days can you do without Taika? Well, how come he's touching his own dick? What the fuck? Without Taika? <laughs> alone time? I mean, I could do a long time without him. 
Yeah, he, 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 yeah, he can do I've both. I've been to a long time with, I mean, I always think about him. I look in, in our security cameras, I always look. But uh, these days, since we have them a lot, it's nice to have a long time. Oh, yeah, so you, you so appreciate you're, So you got too much taka going on. That's crazy. You feel like you have a lot? Because you only see him like one hour a day because you come home pretty late. That's yeah, a lot yeah. for you? Yeah, but that's, wow. but that's still, no, no, that's I'm, a com dad time. no I'm comparing it before. to us, though. I'm comparing it to us. Oh, I see. So if I come home and we have like three hours family time and then only one hour of us, it's always three to one, three to one, three to one. And you know how robotic I am, that all adds up. So I'm like, fuck, I got 12 hours of Taika, but maybe only three hours of Geo. Aw, that's cute. He wants more Geo time. Yeah. I mean, does, who doesn't? He just turned it all around. Who doesn't? Who doesn't? Yeah. Do you, right? How about you, Geo? Joe, do, you want more, do you want more time with me? <laughs> huh? Oh. <laughs> that got awkward. Oh. Geo <laughs> can't go without Taika for more than yeah, that. That was my that was my next question. Yeah, no, I'm attached. I fucking like, like three, minutes? three hours, I think maybe. Two hours. How are you gonna survive in Vegas? Yeah. yeah. I mean I'll be with you guys. So it'll be fun. Like I'll constantly be checking. Yeah, I'll constantly be checking, but I'll try to be in the moment with you guys. But then once we're not, I'm not in the moment with you guys, I'm gonna be like on the fucking thing. Aww. Like mm -hmm. You know what I wish? I wish the security cams had like smell of vision too, because he smells good. Yeah. Even when he stinks, he smells good. He's pretty stinky. I could bite your arm. Oh, you yeah, could bite my thigh. Oh, I could slap the camera away. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Who's gonna drool? Who's gonna drool? I'm not gonna be there. <laughs> we all look at David. Up, how, come, how come you're not going on a trip, man? Yeah, what happened? Some foods episode. Uh, Why do you keep choosing them over us every yeah, time? Well, I'm contracted. <laughs> you're too. Contractual obligation. Here too. Huh? Yeah, you didn't come with us last time. I did. Yeah, he, yeah, he, he did. was there. Not the last time. Yeah, he was. To Michael Jackson? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. I had the Polaroids that we took photos of yeah. with you in it, you son of a bitch. I remember. Oh, Thank you're you. right, because you kept going away with Mario. They leave like, early, like, they when, come yeah, late. I was like, when is he gambling with us? Never. And it's like, we I gambled actually, the we best that together. I could. I just remember you guys waking up early and exercising, and yeah. then I went to the gym. Yeah, yeah we I, did our exercise. And, and you guys caught me during my health, that's why I just started losing weight. I remember. Too. So I was very dedicated. You were. Oh, it was your birthday, they sang to you in the... I was drunk, yeah. that's right. Yeah. And the girl had a really good voice. Yeah, she did. See? You see, but you want to miss that again. I don't want to. Yeah, you do. Wait, Where are you doing San Fus? I think we're going to be in Houston. Wait, so your birthday's coming up? Yeah, it's going to be... It's an Aries. 30th. March March 30th. What the fuck did you have to think about? Huh? <laughs> You're know. like, it's March... What the fuck? I don't, I don't remember mine either. Yeah. I almost never remember. Number 18. 18. Yeah. I always think about it. Oh, really? 18 or 17 Remember's or 19? Second. His birthday's coming up too? Dia de los Muertos. Day to dead? One, three. Right after, yeah. Yeah. Joe, April 12. April 12. Yep, we're all really close, dude. Yeah. Don't you, wait, yeah, that's true. And uh -huh. Tiff's is November 29th? Yay! Yeah. Dude, let's just celebrate our birthday together because my parents are coming on my birthday. Go to Vegas. Stupid. I can't, fool. I'm you really suck. Sure. Hey, you should go to Vegas. <laughs> Do a send foods in Vegas. Dude, that's interesting a, then. So you know that much ahead of time? When you're going? I do. I didn't get a notice. But you canceled the podcast the day before? Huh. Interesting. Oh. Ooh, David, you in trouble, David. Get yeah, David in trouble. Get David Listen, in trouble. I've already explained this to you before. I don't care. All Explain right. it to the public. <laughs> <laughs> so what you happened, deserve what to know. Shame. What already happened a couple shame. of times is that we get these d dates ahead of time, right? But sometimes <laughs> they want to shoot the day before. Yeah. If it's good, good, then I, then we'll fly out on a Friday. Then I could shoot on a Thursday. Which is but, today, which is when we shoot JK News. Yeah, so I want to make sure that it's cemented, at least that I know that I'm not going on a Thursday, which will be about a few days before. So for this, either way, I'm going to be gone that whole weekend. David said if he misses uh, the podcast appearance on our podcast the next week, that he will die. It would be the third he time that he missed he'll actually. It would be the oh, second time. Second time. The first time I just completely ignored the email. Yeah, yeah. Because <laughs> she never emails me. I'm like, who is this? <laughs> and I moved on. And I was like, oh, wait, it's Nikki. <laughs> I was like, hello. Thanks, David. Yeah, see, right when I saw your name, I realized it was you. I was like, dude. Come it's on, it's literally the first word in the email. Yeah. <laughs> It could have been anybody though. Who spells Nikki with two Ks, huh? And I. Anyways, Vegas is great. Yeah, come. You won't know. You, come. you know what I realized too? Uh, oh, wait, are you good. going to Japan? I am going to Japan. Oh, oh yeah. I'll get all serious. <laughs> <laughs> I am going to Japan. You know what I realized too recently? So there's this joint out in uh, Vegas joint. called District One. They do this lobster, lobster fun thing, right? And Tim and I were talking about this so somebody that we know that says that they didn't like the lobster fun. They said it wasn't good. And this person does like 
like mukbang stuff for a living, from now on, that person's taste buds are trash to me. Really? Why? Do bomb. we know this person? Because it's bomb? Because it's bomb? Because it's actually really good. Maybe they got a bad lobster. Right? So for them, I guess like what they were thinking was with the broth, they're like, I want it to be more lobster, I wanted all this other stuff. I was like, yo, it tastes good. Like their portions are good too. They also have like this oxtail fried rice thing, which is delicious. Sounds this good. One shout outs to you guys, I'm putting you, it's fucking delicious. They have really Maybe good Maybe we'll go too. check it out when we're out there. <laughs> without you. Without you. Their cocktails are fucking bomb too. I like cocktails. Dope. Yeah. I'm hungry. Yeah, you Las are? Vegas has a big foodie scene. Yeah, it's just Vegas is, yeah, the, yeah. is that place yeah. where if it's successful somewhere else in the in the country, they're it's gonna, gonna open, go there. It's yeah. Gonna go you're there. right. If you're an Eiffel Tower, you're gonna go to Vegas. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> or a Statue of Liberty, yep. you'll you be in take Vegas. The architecture all over the world. Yeah. And then they bring it there. They're like, oh, this succeeded here? Okay, I'll bring it. Are you guys gonna do the buffet thing? Of course. You Locking know what? Up. We're paying for the buffets. <gasps> All right. But it's at the Rio and the Bellagio. Oh, Still bomb. Oh, Rio's good. good. I know the seafood buffet. Yeah. Remember when we went? Yeah. I like it. Yeah. Really the Bellagio good. one's good too. The win yeah. is good too. Yeah, but it's it's because it's we have shows scheduled oh. at that hotel, so I thought it was just easier to do okay. that. The win yeah, yeah. is the one they have prime rib there, huh? They all feel the same to me. The win is good, yeah, but you know I don't know. It's been a while since I did the buffet thing, so I miss it. But every single time, like you had to do the buffet, you had to go to the beach. I mean, not the beach, the pool area, the day club yeah, or whatever. Yeah. You have to go club and even though you don't like it, you're just like claustrophobic in there. I just yeah. gamble. Yeah, so me too. I love gamble. gambling. But when I, when I first started going and I was like 21, I tried to do all that stuff and I'm like, oh, I don't have no money, right? And then you go back and then you finally get to do it and you're like, this is it? <laughs> like that, that's it? You know, like this is nothing. Oh, the, the, all this, the Yeah, you do all stuff. the stuff and then I actually enjoy all the grandpa stuff. Yeah. Do you remember the uh, Gordon Ramsay burger place that we went to? I didn't go there, but you guys did. Yes. I didn't go there. Did yeah, we did. Was I sleeping? No, you were. Oh, wait. I don't remember. I remember going with Beach Hoy. Oh, I was there too. Oh, was it the time we went and then I threw up? I had a. I, had I don't a remember. Food poisoning. It was like burgers, right? You were there, yeah, it was burgers. Did you like it or did you not? I didn't like it. So, right. So, so I did a video on it, right? And I was just saying, like, this wasn't a good burger. It wasn't. Dude, Gordon Ramsay's fans are fucking fanatics. They're like, what the fuck do you know about a good burger? And I was like, did you even read the reviews on the place? is trash. But I saw him at the office. Oh yeah. What? Our office, what? I saw him. He was yeah. filming or something, right? Didn't you say something? Yeah, like I saw that? him. That's so cool. Steve would have flipped out. He loves Gordon Ramsay. Oh, he always does Gordon Ramsay impressions on Tasty Tuesday. That's mm -hmm. tight. Gordon Ramsay's face looks like a scrotum. <laughs> <laughs> it's worse in person. Oh really? No makeup, huh? How close were you to him that you saw him? Maybe from like me to Gio or a little bit further. Oh, that's pretty yeah. close. Because I was in my car and then I was pulling up and then me and Pat are like looking at each other like, who's that's this Ramsay. guy? Well, his outfit was hideous. <laughs> he had like a tan jumpsuit that was super flamboyant, looked like a pimp would wear. And then, um, yeah, it was like one of those fleece, like, you know, like, like, a onesie? like a Armenian, Armenian gangster, you know, like it was a tracksuit kind of thing, but it was like fleece. Like, oh. yeah. I would never yeah. picture Gordon Ramsay. Me neither. Right, right. And then like, are you sure it was Gordon Ramsay? Well, I was thinking that and he goes, is that Gordon Ramsay? And I'm like, Oh shit, that is. And as soon as we locked eyes, he like looks down like that, like, oh fuck, fans. Uh, he was with the entourage and everything uh, in like a fucking like top notch Range Rover and stuff. So oh, I would have like, been yeah. so offended. He was like, oh, I'm being annoyed. He's like, dude, I'm fucking famous too, jackass. <laughs> All right, I'm doing, I'm doing this to you. Uh, yeah. Because <laughs> like, you recognize me. Yeah. Oh shit, David's so fans. I would run up to him and go like this, just so he noticed. <laughs> So he notices that I don't want him to notice. Yeah, yeah. Can you imagine yeah. that? Yeah. You go out of your way, you're like, no, 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 no autograph. He's only a one person guy, too. <laughs> no entourage. He's running up to him. <laughs> no entourage. Please stop, stop, stop. No pictures, please. You do all of it yourself? <laughs> yep. Stop, stop, stop. I have the photos out. Stop, stop. <laughs> Fucking make it disgusted of myself. One man bar for us. You know what's surprisingly good? The pizza at Wolfgang Pucks. Have you guys ever got that? No. It's fucking good. Bomb. Why did you get that? I feel like if you're gonna go to Wolfgang Pups, Pucks, why would you get pizza? We, we, uh, What should you get? Well, like, I would get whatever their star thing is on the that. menu, I so guess. We, we, before our UFC fight, we ate there, and we got our star stuff, and all the stuff was really good, remember? We ate with James. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We ate there, and then, uh, me being the fat guy that I am. Yeah, I you're so like, fat. I ain't gonna fucking finish. I mean, well, this yeah, isn't gonna I had fill some of your up. pizza, that was, was good. Yeah, I was like, this isn't gonna fill me up. I gotta get a pizza. Cause I also heard of David Chang talk about his pizza and how it's really good. And I ate it, I'm like, damn, this is really good. And then before a funk concert last month, 
I confirmed it because there's a Wolfgang Pucks in LA Live, mm -hmm. and it was really, really good. I haven't even stepped foot inside of Wolfgang Pucks. Get the pizza if you do. It's so yeah. good. You know what blows my mind about food is that it's just like any other art, right? But then you need it to survive. Because taste is just, uh, it's a sense just like anything else. There's different perspectives that's tied to that, right? So like what's good is really subjective. Yeah. But what people consider to be good and all that blows my freaking mind of why they think something is good. Yeah, it depends on what the experience you want to buy. So like some people love like elitist type of lifestyles. So anything, if it's elite, it's yeah. like, oh, that's Automatically good. Yeah. Well, what blows my mind is that when you taste the ingredient, if you understand and you taste, you're like, oh, this is- like, uh, Oh, you don't have a developed palate. Yeah, but this is bad. Like it's- yeah, Your it's, palate it's is not elite. <laughs> like, can't you tell that's not, that's not prime or like, you know, like, I don't know. Yeah. Cause you could mask it by making it look beautiful. Yeah. I mean, that's for anything though. Cause that's even how equipment is. Everything, like, clothing. Everything, clothing, everything, everything yeah. else. Like people can say arguably like, like Jordan comes out. People will like it just because something is new versus seeing it like spec for spec, right? Well, cause so, of the novelty, right? Yeah. So it's <laughs> like, I'll, I'll say some stuff like, like for example, like, I like cameras, right? And for me, if it looks good, it looks good. And cameras are more for me, if it works with what you're doing, then it's perfect for you. Mm -hmm. It's not to say that it's better just because of the stats of it, right? But then I like I had like a conversation with a friend of mine. He goes like, okay, well, I really liked, uh, it was like, it was a new mirrorless camera that came out. And I looked at it from frame for frame and I was like, this doesn't look good, right? And he goes, what are you talking about? It's new, it's newer than your camera. I was like, that doesn't mean that it looks better though. Right. It's still a shittier fucking camera. But just because for him, new means better. Right. For him, he's stuck on that. And so I had to find a YouTube video, spec for spec, mm -hmm. put it out. I'm like, do you see now? He goes, oh, I guess it is. It's like MacBooks. Like MacBook Pros are super expensive. Yeah. But if you're used to like, for example, I don't know anything about computers and I'm used to using a MacBook Pro to edit, to edit videos and to do airdrop and all that stuff. And I know that there's more powerful computers out there. I'm just not used to them. So I'll pay more even though. Yeah. But it's because from my experience, like this is the best thing for my experience. Yeah, I'm yeah. used to it. I wish it wasn't that expensive. I don't, I like my 2013 MacBook Pro way more than my 2018 one that I just bought because I just like the way it functioned like people, better. People can but, literally convince themselves of anything. Yeah. yeah. But you're also not going around saying this is the best right, right. and everything else sucks. Yeah, 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 yeah. But it's all perspective, like what, what you want out of it, right? Exactly. It's, like, it's the best if you want power me. and GPU and all that stuff, then you're gonna go get a PC and you don't care like what it looks like or if it can connect to your phone or whatever. But if you want like more like just efficiency with workflow. Then yeah. that's the one for yeah, you, then exactly. it's the best for you. But it, it's funny because people will argue about that all the time. They'll be like, you're just an Apple fanboy. And then the fanboys are like, no, it's actually so better because of this. I like how that's serious because here, like, we fuck around with it, but yeah. we're not even serious. No, people are so and serious about it. And I'm like, damn. Oh, yeah. It's like, I don't it's think any of us here fucking cares. Yeah. <laughs> it's a joke. Like, when we make fun of Android users, yeah. And yeah. oh, yeah, they're people, in there. People they think, love. like, it's super real. Yeah. yeah. I'm, I'm like, like no. no, we don't really give a fuck, bro. But then I, I feel like younger people people for sure probably get like made fun of because of shit like that maybe. And maybe that's what it is. But when we do it, we're joking around. Like who the fuck really cares? Yeah, it's we don't give this. a fuck. Hello? Yeah. <laughs> you know, like, I you thought know? we were serious guys. <laughs> <laughs> like I've been dividing these people in my head the whole time. I've been hating yeah. David because he got this phone. Yeah, I thought I know, we were yeah. like, no. <laughs> How fucking dare you? Let me write a note about your hate robot. I do, I do not like when the group texts turn to green. I know, I hate I don't that. Like and it. then when you want to laugh or like something, yeah, it, it turns says, into a whole nother text. Tiff, you liked time, this. Every time I like something or thumbs it up, I think of your mom. Like, actually, <laughs> oh, yeah. out. every wrote, time without she fail. Wrote, she like, she wrote, wrote like? That was so Because, okay, she was the only Android user, and so all of us, when we like a comment, it, because it, she has her Android, it, it writes it out like, Nikki laughed at Melanie's photo or whatever, and she thought we were all writing it, so she goes, laughed at. Oh my God, dude, that's <laughs> so photo, funny. And then she put LOL and she put a comment in there too. And I'm like, you wrote that. And she's like, no, I didn't. <laughs> she tried to go, she tried to, she tried to backtrack. That's even funnier. Yeah, I'm like, yeah. I'm not old. You wrote a comment with it. You can't do that if you like a comment. <laughs> you know what I like to do on Android? Android has some of the jankiest little gifs and I'll just send it just to fucking make fun of myself. <laughs> it's like this dog that goes, okay. And it's the ugliest fucking cartoon drawing I've ever seen in my life. And I'm like, this is the ugliest thing I've ever seen. And I'm gonna send that just to piss people off. <laughs> 
Android all the way. <laughs> Do emojis come out different for you? Yeah, yeah. You, you don't see them? So. Yeah, you're smiley. They're, they're weird. So they're yeah. like a little bit more 3D or something. Yeah, they're way more 3D. Looking. Really? They look a little bootleg. Huh.